Hello, welcome back to another tutorial video. In this video, I will show you how to model this name tag with FreeCAD 1.0. Let's get started. Pick this parametric part design template. I am on part design workbench. Click on create sketch command and pick XY plane. Click rectangle command and check this box to make rounded corners. Draw a rectangle, make it 50 mil by 20 mil. Corner radius 3 mil. Right click to exit the command. Close the window. Click on pack command. Check reversed option. And type 3 for the length. Click OK. Pick this face and click on create sketch command. Pick this tool to copy external reference lines from existing solid. Pick this edge and this edge and this corner and this corner. Right click to exit the command. Click on create line tool and draw a line between these two points. Right click to exit the command, select the line and make it construction line by clicking on this tool. Now pick the centered rectangle command from this drop down menu. Check rounded corners option and draw at the center of this line. Make sure the cursor looks like this. Click and move the mouse to somewhere here at this corner. Make sure you don't snap to any points or lines. Click, enter 2 mil for the corner radius. Click on dimensions command to add the dimensions like this. Close the window. Click on pocket tool. Enter 1 mil and click OK. Now switch the workbench to draft. Let's look at from the top view. Click on this shape from text tool. Click somewhere here. Type the name. Type 6 mil for the height. Choose the font from the fonts folder. Pick any font you like and click open. And click OK. Pick this move tool to move the text. Switch to isometric view. Switch back to part design workbench. Click on model tab. Click and drag this onto the body. Pick the pad tool. Check reverse option. Enter 1 mil for the length. Click OK to close. Select this face and click on Create Sketch Tool. 
Again, use this command to create external reference lines. Pick these two edges. Draw a line at the middle of this line. Type 2 mil for the length and click. Click on circle command. Draw two circles like this. Make sure it is fully constrained. Pick this line and convert it to construction line. Close the window. Click on Pad tool and check this reversed option. Type 3 for the length. Click OK. Navigate the model to see if all good. Let's switch to wireframe style so we can see all the edges. Pick these two edges and click on fillet command to make it round. Enter 3 mil and click OK. Let's switch back to shaded surface style. Let's add small radius at the edges. Click on this face and control select this bottom face. Click on fillet command and add 0.2 mil radius. Click OK to close. Control select all the top faces of the text. And add 0.2 mil radius. Click OK to close. Check the model. Thanks for watching my video. If you have any questions, please leave in the comments below. Please subscribe and stay tuned for more frequent tutorial videos. See you soon.